Okay. Hey, everybody. Oh, wait. I thought I was taking a photo. Okay. Okay. Hi, I'm Holly from Holly Coleman Rocks. And I'm Raimi from Some Ten Like a White Girl. Um, we're about to go to Jamaica in like a week and a half, huh? A week and two days. Um, and so we're preparing ourselves. We we feel like we need to really do our, our YouTube research on our travel destination. Neither one of us have been to Jamaica before. So if y'all could give us any travel tips... That would be great. Okay, you just what are you doing? Okay, so we're gonna watch the ten things not to do in Jamaica. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Let's that get, wasn't nice. Let's get this video started. Odds nice are good that you're headed for a spirited but relaxing okay. island vacation. Okay. But there's much more to Jamaica than great music and gorgeous weather. So follow really? these tips to keep safe and have fun while visiting like Jamaica. Know before you go. One, don't forget about the State Department. Okay. You should know before you travel that both sexual assault and armed robbery are common throughout the nation. In some cases, even inside gated resorts. <laughs> Two, don't expect help from the cops. Oh. Oh, that's great. The Jamaican police force is universally underpaid and understaffed. Their attention is mostly focused on more serious <laughs> crime. So a tourist's stolen camera doesn't rank high Stealing on the list of priorities. <laughs> Three, don't try to get around without a driver. In Jamaica, they drive on the wrong, well, left side of the road. It can be a little perplexing, but for a small fee, you can hire a driver for the day to help you get around efficiently and safely. Four, don't backpack through Jamaica. People who backpack through Jamaica essentially put a target on their back, attracting the worst of the island's criminal element. Your best bet is to spend most of your time in highly populated areas. That doesn't seem like a good idea. Five, do either. your research. Where you spend your vacation will determine what there is to do. Love the nightlife? Then Negril has tons of thriving hotspots. Taking your That's family for some staying. fun in the sun? Montego off. Bay is full of family-friendly resorts. Want to experience Jamaica's inland vacation. paradise? Check out Ocho Rios. Six, don't look at the merchants. When you're browsing at the shops on the island, avoid direct eye contact with the merchants. They will take it as a sign that you want to buy something. Oh. But if you're just looking, keep your eyes on the merchandise and not on the owner. So when I make a transaction, Seven, I don't choose American dollars. So I'm wondering... While good old-fashioned greenbacks are welcome on the island, you should consider using the Jamaican dollar. You'll find that you don't have to worry about exchange rates and the locals will appreciate it. Okay. Eight, don't get up tight. The entire country is filled with people who are looking on the bright side. And while they're eager to please, they're not in any big hurry. So you shouldn't be either. No one wants to hang around with a grumpy tourist. Nine, don't be afraid to explore. There is a heck of a lot more to the island of Jamaica than just lounging on its world-class beaches. There are a lot of great shopping spots and natural beauty like Dunn's River Falls. 10. Don't worry about finding a good beach. The best part about Jamaica is that no matter where you book your reservations, Jamaica will have a pristine stretch of golden sand waiting for you. Don't spend a ton of time trying to find the right beach. They're pretty much all that beach. Where do you want to know what not to do in next? Comment below. Okay, so... What are you taking away from that, Ren? Um, that the police are not going to help us. Okay. All right, let me pause that. If we need help. January 2000. Oh my God, pause. Okay. Don't be so uptight. Okay. Uh, so, please. So, we got to remember the Department of State. Right? Because that's what they say in the beginning. That's the number one thing. 
were member of the Department of State. But what about so, it? Like, if we got in trouble? 17, we, we had gone, gone to watch one of my nephews play basketball. basketball. Or if we have a problem. Okay. Or something. Uh, that we should explore, but explore with caution and not go backpacking across the mountains. God, neither one of us are going to do that. Like we're, right. We are not athletic, y'all. Not at all. Like, you, you know, when I get my our kickboxing videos up, you'll see uh, it's just a sad, sad situation with us. We are, you know, super. We're some big cats. Yeah, we're super out of shape. Um, so hiking, not doing that. Mm. No. Um, if we could, like, find a group of people that would carry us around so we don't have to ever walk or move. Oh my God, that would be so amazing. That would be like amazing. Like back in the pyramid times. Right. Egyptian. <laughs> yeah. Times. The Egyptian times. Pyramid times. Yeah. Where they would carry around people. Well, I have two pyramids on my head. <laughs> That's my boss calling. Oh my god. Okay, wait, hang on. Fun police says, let's turn this off for a second.